Ooh. Well, there goes the game. I oh, oh, no, it, di it didn't crash this time. That's cool. All right. Mm. Don't turn into the Russian. Oh, 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 oh. Should I even hit play? I'm gonna have to probably remove a lot of... I'm gonna have to edit a lot of the math out. Let's hit play. Oh, never mind, it's... Help? Help, you know? Help? Quit? No. Isn't that just French for a Wii? Uh... What do you want me to do, game? No, seriously, what does it want me to do? Does it want me to quit? Oh! Console, loop, stat... Loop star admin override. What? Is it something I could have done but didn't? What? I think. Oh. Yes, yes, do it. Console loop star. Am I supposed to like type that in? Oh! Oh! F1 is console. Okay, okay. It's kind of in gibberish, but. Console loop start. Uh, admin override. Excellent. All right. Well, this is a little interesting. Hopefully, there's not more fucking math puzzles. That would that would really suck. And I forgot I had to keep myself a little quiet so I don't. Ear rape my own microphone. Oh. Love these puzzles. That's not it? Oh. That looked like it was super close. Well, that's not it. Oh, okay. I see. I'm supposed to do that. Ah. Oh. Apparently, I fucked it up. Okay. I presume this is right in some ways, but at the same time, it's not. Yep. Wait, am I missing something? These don't align properly. But it never does. The red horizontal lines feel like they sort of line up, and these arrows line up. But this, this uh, inner circle never goes perfectly up. So I'm gonna have to presume that it wants it to be like that. This isn't, oh, oh, there we go, finally. It was just the other way around with like the horizontal lines I was trying to line up, the down arrow was meant to be the other way around. Otherwise, hey, I got it. Someone's in here with me. But why are they with me? Oh, fire! Nice. Blue gem. I don't... What? I guess that's kind of interesting. Oh. Okay, not... Oh, I guess that's close enough. Someone was hung! What does this mean? Oh. Stop! Someone's telling me to stop. Well, stop giving me such easy fucking puzzles. I turned off the fire? Interesting. So where's the last gem? Where is... The last gem. I think it has to do with this furnace for some reason. I don't know, let's put the gems in already to see... Uh, I guess that's in its permanent position. Not that one. We're missing... Square X square X square. Oh, oh the gems popped out after. Okay. The vent... Not the vent. Not this 
dead young person. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, seven, five, nine. What? Seven, five, nine. Yeah, so it's, the question is, where's the last puzzle, essentially? Oh, wait, a rock. Rock! Smash! Oh, no, fuck you. Uh... Is it supposed to be Roman numerals, maybe? It was 759? 759. 7... Let's go with the... Roman numerals? Okay. So it would be... V... 7? Wait. Yeah, this still works, but... Seven. That, wait, that doesn't. This, this don't even line up. Five nine. What? I would need an X. An X. Wait. Oh, X. Okay. Ha! It actually detected it. Nice. Nice. You can fuck up. Oh, 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 oh. Slow. It's, it's really not wanting me to get this shit over to the... Wait, was that a face on the mannequin? This is not a basement. I'm gonna look at that mannequin again. No, oh, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting game so far. It's not a basement, it says. Well, fuck you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get out of this non-basement. Give me the key. Is this Simon Says now? Red, yellow, blue, yellow. Oops. Red, yellow, blue. Yellow, red, blue. Blue, yellow, yellow, red, red. I hate Simon Says. Oh. Come on. Ah. Oh. Ah. Uh. There we go. Fuck me. I hate Simon Says. I have to like turn off my brain and my eyes just go as I just focus. Trap door key. Let's try it again. Very slowly. Looks like the room's actually permanently changed. Please. Mount! Uh, so it's one of those games that look for my computer name, or look for a name I have inputted to try to creepily know your name. So if you name yourself somewhere in your computer, it will know your last name. Um, and use it to sort of try to creep you. I've seen games do this before, so it's not surprising. But to, to see anything or anyone call me Mounts, Mounts used to be my username what is this a bomb mounts used to be the username i used to go as so people would just simply refer to me as mounts which was it which is my last name but it used to be my username so you may as well think that mounts was technically my is is my last name but was used like a first name to those online so anyone calling me mounts it's just it's it's almost nostalgic to me anyways is this the end of the game, or do I need to really just stop the episode here? Let's see how this goes. Something about World War II? Congratulations! Mm-hmm. I need some coffee, thank you. You fool! Oh, wow. Condescending, wow. I've made a grave mistake by escaping my virtual reality prison that's not a basement. Okay. And what would be the better thing? Stay in a fucking dungeon that's full of fucking mathematical puzzles and shit? Okay, what, what do you want me to do? I am one of many safekeeping programs made by a secret organization no, called... Our purpose is to store and lock down Sentinel. 
a highly intelligent system capable of accessing and manipulating any data from any device on the grid. Hospital records, bank accounts, top secret facility locations, and maybe even nuclear launch code if given enough time. For years I have safely kept a part of it within my walls, my code. And just like many others, you helped it clear all of my security layers. Well, maybe you shouldn't have security layers that are with simple additional and subtracting puzzles. And maybe you should have it so it's like something only geniuses would be able to fucking solve, you know? They don't hire the best. You helped it escape. Wow. We are not human proof after all. It's only a matter of time before it completely rebuilds its system. Whatever chaos and start <coughs> destruction it brings in the future, always remember that you have made yourself a part of this. Okay. It used you, yes. But you let yourself answer. The basement's calling. Ooh. Oh, that's good. I can see this becoming a trilogy, sort of like don't escape, or, and you know, like, I can't remember the game particularly that I'm thinking about, but it became a trilogy of, like, I don't even know where I'm going with this, it's just, it's, I remember a bunch of really well-known escape games that Markiplier played, and they became pretty decently hyped, uh, a trilogy. I could see this game becoming the very same thing where this is just the beginning, and this, where you may think it's, oh, it's the ending. And it's a game by Alicia Ramos, or Elisha, and James Pajunar. Hopefully I'm not butchering your names, but this could be both an ending and the beginning. Who knows? Because it was an interesting game, I don't much really care for the mathematical puzzles, but puzzles and horror almost come hand in hand, maybe thanks to Resident Evil and Alone in the Dark. Because Alone in the Dark basically invented survival horror, in a way, or it just did. But outside of that, I don't know, I enjoyed the game, I hope you enjoyed this gameplay too. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a full subscriber, hit that bell notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching, until the next time. So upon starting the game again, we can come to realize that the main menu that we were used to seeing, this is a camera perspective looking down on the wood flooring with the trap door now open. So, kind of interesting, but this is now the game's main menu. It's just sort of stuck here. The trap door open.